Welcome to this video on managing metadata in Tableau. You can download the workbook to follow along in your own copy of Tableau. Tableau cannot write changes back to the data source. However, we can modify the metadata for use in Tableau directly in the data pane. There are a lot of features. We'll just go through a few examples. Fields we don't need can be hidden, like order priority. I've already hidden a lot of fields in the data source. We can rename fields. Click twice slowly, and we'll call this shipping date. We can create a hierarchy simply by dragging a subordinate field onto another field. We'll call this products. To add another field, simply drag it into the hierarchy. And we can always drag to rearrange the order. This creates the ability to drill down in the view. We can also create folders by right-clicking and selecting Group by Folder. Then right-clicking again to create a folder. We'll call this Customers. And then simply drag the fields into the folder. Collapsing these can be handy if there's a long list of dimensions or measures. A handy thing to know is that Tableau has this search function, which is helpful if fields are collapsed in folders or hierarchies. We can change the default data type, say row ID, by clicking on the icon in front of the field and changing the data type. We can assign default colors simply by bringing a field such as market to color and editing the colors. That choice will be remembered the next time we use the field. If we right click on a measure and go to default properties, we see there are several features nested here, such as adding a comment, editing the default number format, and changing the default aggregation. Hovering over the field discount shows us that a comment has been added for that field. If we bring discount into the view, we see that it comes out as an average instead of the normal default sum, and turning on labels shows us that it has been formatted as a percentage. An important thing to note here is that all of this is part of the definition of the data connection, not actual changes to the underlying data. When using a published data source from Tableau Server or Tableau Online, we will not be able to do things like edit or remove existing hierarchies, aliases, or calculations. But we can extend metadata, such as authoring new calculations for use in the workbook. This will not write back to modify the original data source. To easily get back to the data connection window, simply click on the data source tab. You may be prompted to reconnect to the data source, including navigating to a flat file on your machine. Alternatively, if at any time we realize we need to modify the data connection, simply right click on the data source to pull up the menu. This menu lets us control many aspects of the data connection, such as renaming it, turning on or off extracts, creating or editing data source filters, publishing or saving data sources. Thank you for watching this video on managing metadata. We invite you to continue with the free training videos to learn more about using Tableau. For more information on extracts, continue to managing extracts, which builds from this workbook.